We're looking at the character which means to like or likeable in this video tutorial. You can see it consists of two parts and the element on the left is a slightly squished up version of the character meaning female. You can see it there on the top left hand side of the screen. Let's just have a look at its stroke order. So we start at the top and we draw in the left hip and then we put the right hip and finally we draw the arms across like that. That's the element for female. Now in the kanji for like it's only half a kanji so obviously we have to squish it up to make it fit in but we still have left hip and then we put the right hip and finally we draw the arms at an angle to leave room for the right hand side. So the character for to like is made up of the female element and the element on the right of this kanji means child. You can see here it is on the right hand side of your screen when it's being used as a complete character in its own right. Now the stroke order starts at the top, we go across and draw the head of the child, then we draw the child's body with an optional tick and then we draw the arms across like that. Now that character actually means child and it forms the right hand element of the character meaning to like. So let's just pop the child in there. So there's his head. Here's the child's body and there's its arms. And we get a female element with a child element. Now we don't know exactly what was in the minds of the ancient Chinese when they developed this character, but I think most people would agree that a mother and child or female and child is a really likeable combination and that has the core meaning of like. Now to write the Japanese word which means like or likeable we actually have to add an okurigana hiragana. That's the hiragana that goes after a kanji to write an entire word. So in this case the word for like is suki and the character that we've just learned is the su and then we have to add the ki. So let's do that together. We've just learnt the stroke order for this su part and it's the female element on the left, that's the left hip, the right hip and the arms. And then on the right hand side we draw the child element. There's the head, here we have the body with the optional tick and the arms going across like that. And that gives us our su from su ki. Now all we have to do to finish the word is to add the hiragana, ki. There it is, optional tick. And we finish it off. This of course is the handwritten form of the hiragana ki. If it were written by a computer, then the bottom round shape would be joined up. And there we have su ki, ski, which means like or likeable.